Hi guys, I'm Olivia with iFixit, and even though, as you can see, we're still in lockdown, I wanted to let you know about some cool things we've been working on. For the last four weeks, we've been crowdsourcing thousands of repair documents for hundreds of different ventilator models. These machines are critical in the fight against COVID-19, as they help patients breathe mechanically when they're too weak to do so themselves. We've been seeing stories on the news about the ventilator shortages all over the country, and to make matters worse, these machines are running almost non-stop and they're breaking. Or, as we saw in California, they're arriving already broken. Biomedical technicians, usually known as biomeds, are the repair experts in hospitals, and they need to spend every minute they have fixing these machines, not searching the internet for repair manuals. That's where we come in. iFixit is the online repair manual for everything, and we're hoping to make it a central repair resource for biomeds all over the world. The closest thing to an existing central resource is Frank's Hospital Workshop, a fantastic website run out of Tanzania with hundreds of manuals and very helpful how-to resources for maintaining medical equipment. But Frank's site is a one-person operation, and a single point of failure should overwhelming traffic come calling. Right now, we're working on organizing the thousands of repair manuals we've received. It's a huge undertaking. As of this week, we have over 500 manuals for ventilators made by 58 different companies, and more than 900 anesthesia system service manuals online so far. These integrated anesthesia machines are being used as backup ventilators, and we're working on adding other high-priority equipment to this list. We've also got teams of engineering students from our local university, Cal Poly, working with our EDU team to turn these repair manuals into step-by-step -step repair guides, and more volunteers are ready to translate those guides into other languages. This will allow anyone, biomedical engineer or medical professional, to get the machines fixed and back to saving lives. Yesterday, five states released a statement demanding manufacturers release all service manuals, service keys, and schematics during this crisis, enabling hospitals to make repairs to ventilators and maximize their supply and ability to serve more COVID-19 patients. We've been thrilled at the response we've seen from the community on this project, and we're grateful to everyone who has volunteered time, submitted manuals, and told your local biomeds about it. Our goal is to make this a robust, accessible resource to help medical professionals save lives.